happy Saturday. No, Friday. What am I talking about Saturday? <laughs> Hello, the weekend is here, whether it's Friday or Saturday. Welcome. This is Orbit Jewelry. My name is Kim DuPont. Hello, hello. All right, I am gonna get our Facebook page up and get our goodies pasted in. Make sure you say hello. If you see that live red button, it means we are live. If you no longer see that button, it means you're watching the replay. You can still claim from the replay. You're just gonna comment sold and the number of the PC you see above my head. Um, you do need to be registered if you are not a registered shopper yet. All right, let me get our registration up. Hello, hello. <clears throat> I hope you all had a fabulous week. I don't know about you guys, but um, the week seemed a little long. <laughs> which I think is pretty common for right after the holidays, right? Hello, Miss Darlene. Hello, Lisa. All right, let me get this pinned in. All right, we are ready to party. Hello, Jonna. Did you all have a good week? Was it long for you too? Because it kind of felt like a long week to me. <laughs> Having the two weeks in a row, uh, short week, work weeks, it definitely um, drags a little bit. Hey, Miss Edna. All right. So we had some fun earlier with that post. And one of you uh, got mine right on the nose. I don't know if you saw my comment on it. Thank you, Miss Edna. Tonight... We have, I have a ton of stuff to show you guys. Um, I've got some treasures. So some last call items, fast fingers. Uh, if you are new to paparazzi accessories or you're new to Orbit Jewelry, make sure you say hello. Let me know that you are new. Uh, you're in for a treat. Everything you're gonna see tonight is $5. It is all nickel and lead free. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm kind of going into the like little casual mode tonight. <laughs> Chilling. I thought it was Saturday. I don't know where my mind was. <laughs> All right, we are going to get this party started. If at any point anybody has any questions, please let me know. Uh, if there is anything in particular you are looking for, let me know. I am more than happy to grab pieces to show you. Hello, Miss Arden. How are you? How is everybody? Did you all have a good week? It was a good week. It was. Uh, Fashion Fix, you probably had saw notifications. Fashion Fix arrived today. So they all moved from your wait list into your cart. Uh, I was short on a couple of the bracelets. Um, but I'm going to try and get those. I need two more of the pearl and rhinestone so uh, some of you two of you actually still have that in your wait list hey Megan how are you happy Friday all right ladies we're gonna have some fun we are gonna have some fun tonight three pieces in the mystery bling bag you guys are gonna play for um, I'm curious to see what you all have and have not done <laughs> I was cracking up when I saw that and one person actually hit mine right on the nose yeah it was pretty fun hello Miss Denise so anything I have been working on getting pieces that are sitting in your wait list um, the team we try and exchange pieces so we'll hop on the phone or do a um, Brain bubble, a Facebook live chat. Where's my brain? You guys know what I mean. Anyway, so we'll try and exchange pieces. So I was able to get um, quite a few of the pieces that are sitting on wait lists. So as soon as I have those, I'll get them entered in and they'll, you'll see those move over to your cart. 
they definitely won't be in for this weekend. So anybody who is just joining us, um, and just a reminder for my customers, um, carts will expire at 5 p.m. Eastern on Sunday. So our week runs Sunday through Saturday. You can leave your cart open for the week, so that way you're only charged the one shipping rate, which is $4, it's a flat rate, so it doesn't matter if you've got one item or 20, one same $4 flat uh, rate. So we do ask that you check out, preferably by 10 a.m. Eastern on Sunday. That gives us enough time to fulfill all of the orders, get everything packaged up, packaged up and ready for shipment on Monday. And anything that uh, is not checked, if you're not checked out or anything that has been paid for, the cart will expire and dump empty What's the best word for that? <laughs> At 5 p.m. Eastern. So, we, here we go. We are gonna jump in. Anything um, that you claim, you guys know the drill. If it sells out, it will automatically go to your wait list. Leave it in the wait list. Because like I was just saying, I work with team members to try and get those pieces. We try and uh, trade off. I may have something that uh, someone else's customers are waiting for, vice versa. So we work together to get some stuff. We are going to jump in. I'm going to start with the pieces I have on. To comment or to claim a piece, you're just going to comment sold and the number of the piece that you see above my head. New shoppers, make sure you register. You can either click on the registration link or just type the word register. And it will start that registration process, creating an account with Orbit Jewelry and give you access to your shopping cart. It's very similar to Amazon. You can see what's in your cart. You can add to it. You can remove items from it. It's awesome. It's very easy to shop from. Uh, you can shop from our website. It's all going into the same shopping cart. So orbitjewelry.com or from the top of our Facebook page, you can click on Shop Now. That will bring you to the website as well. All right, my friends, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. And I'm curious, did everybody, I know I'm looking at the folks that are here and commented, um, did you all see the post that I put up with, uh, have, never have I ever? <laughs> it was so cute. This is a, Gunmetal, this is the ring that I am wearing. Standard stretch, sold 100. So all of the rings do have a stretch band. They fit uh, sizes six through 10, super comfortable. I never thought I would like a stretch ring, but they are very, very comfortable. You can decide which finger you wanna put it on. Those days that the fingers may be a little bit more swollen, you know what I'm talking about. Um, you can move it. You don't have to worry about, oh, not wearing, being able to wear that ring because it doesn't fit. This is sold one zero zero. One zero zero. All right, you wanna know who matched me exactly? It was Miss Edna. Miss Edna got mine correct. Mine was six. Mine was six. There are six things on that list that I have never done. Never done. I had to tweak the list a little bit because there were things in there that just, yeah. Who, uh, none of us have gone to jail. None of us. <laughs> Alrighty, this is piece number two. Yeah, she hit it right on the head. Now, this is the bracelet I have on. It, I kind of make it a reversible. So it is a black with the rhinestones. But the other side is this, kind of almost a little bit of a metallic gray with the silver studs. So you can see if I hold my wrist this way, the snaps are backwards, right? Because it's inside out, but you can't see that. <laughs> um, 
So you kind of have a two in one with this one. If you want the bling side, wear it that way. And there are two snaps for sizing. Or if you just want the gray, which has, like I said, a little bit of a metallic finish to it. And then the back side of those rhinestones just look like silver little studs. This is sold 101. 101. My necklace, I kind of have a, just a little graphic tee and a layered. Let's make sure I got that one. I did. So this is five chains. So you get that layered look. Medallion Marvel sold 102. Daintier chains. The earrings that come with this have that little matching medallion. I chose to go with a bigger hoop. Really cute. Now this is a necklace, I will tell you, your best bet is to hang it when you take it off because when you, if you just go to put it down, it will tangle because you've got so many different, so many chains on there. So definitely hang it. Otherwise you're gonna be spending time <gasps> untangling anything that has multiple chains. Um, it's just, if you're just gonna put it down into a jewelry box, uh, chances are it will get tangled. Sold 102 and that is the piece I am wearing. 102, 102. So let me ask you, does anybody have that list handy? I'm curious, what are the six things you think I have not done? What are the six things, if you have it handy, and I opened it, what did I do with it? It's minimized here somewhere. I have so many windows open. <gasps> here it is. No, never have, have I ever. So here are the items. Broken a bone, skip, skip school, fired a gun, been skydiving, ridden in a limo, had braces, gotten a massage, gotten a tattoo, been swimming, swimming in the ocean, dyed my hair, watched Star Wars, ridden a horse, sung karaoke, gotten a ticket, gone scuba diving, eaten sushi, been on a train, gone zip lining, been camping, eaten food that fell on the floor, traveled out of the country, been in an ambulance, met someone famous, been on TV, been on a cruise, gotten anything pierced. Well, that one's easy. You know I've gotten pierced here. <laughs> so I'm curious, what do you guys think I haven't done? So speaking of ears, here are the earrings I have on. I actually, I showed these the other night. Um, large hammered texture hoop really really lightweight sold 103 103 103 nope i do have a tattoo <gasps> i do john of scuba diving that is one of them that is one of them i have never done nope i i do i did get a tattoo My mother was mortified. <laughs> nope, I've ridden, I've ridden a horse. I've ridden a horse. I've, I have gone skydiving. I have done that. Actually, we just did that in September for my daughter's uh, birthday. She had, she's been asking for a few years to go. And um, we went. No, I've sung karaoke. <laughs> it was not pretty, but I did it. <laughs> braces, that is one I have not done. I never had braces. Never had braces. Nope, I've eaten sushi. Eaten food off the floor, Lisa Blevins. Okay, I am going to admit this, and I bet you 
most of you have, what's that five second rule? If you drop something, right? Five second rule. Have you not done that? I've done that. Zip lining, Megan, that's correct. I have never done zip lining. I have traveled out of the country. I have never done zip lining. All right, keep going. Yep, scuba diving, never did that. Who has it, right, Jana? I've totally done that. See, we, I think we all have, secretly. Uh, maybe not all of us will admit it, but. Five second rule, yep. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Glow Rider Pink. This is a pink. You've got varying sizes of your faceted beads. I actually have been on TV. I have been on TV. I was on TV uh, my senior year of high school. The, um, no, I have not had braces. That is one. Not have braces. Uh, the local TV station was doing a story on proms and called the school and the school recommended um, my boyfriend and I at the time. So they did a little story. Uh, I think, I don't know if it was channel, it was either channel 10 or channel 12 locally that did that. I've gone longer than five seconds. <laughs> Thanks, Lisa. Oh, Cheryl, that's hysterical. <laughs> that is so funny. Sunlit Splendor. Post back earring. That bright pink little stone. Cute little post earrings. Now, you know I'm going to get an earring caught up in my hoop. What? Oh, sooner or later tonight. Thanks, Lisa. Sold 105. 105. All right. I have so much stuff over here, guys. It is going to, if I don't kind of put things to the side and in my little baskets, we're going to have a gigantic mess. I did meet, uh, I have never fired a gun, never hit in my life. I don't like guns at all. Um, so that is another one that I've never done. But I did meet someone famous. I actually, I met um, Billy Ray Cyrus. <laughs> Do you guys all know who? So we've got scuba diving braces, zip lining, and fire to gun. So that's four. I met Billy Ray Cyrus. Um, I don't, where did I meet him? Backstage somewhere. I can't remember where though. It was many, many, many years ago when he was kind of big. Good old Billy Ray. Achy Breaky Heart, remember that song? <laughs> My mother used to love that song. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right, so you guys have four of them so far. That's right, Edna, broken a bone. I have never, knock on wood, <laughs> I have never broken a bone. Never. So that's, uh, that's five, right? Broken a bone, fired a gun, uh, scuba diving, braces, zip lining. So there's one, there's one more. Yep, yeah, one more that I've never done. All right, we're moving on. I have some really cute hair. Make sure I'm on the right screen. And then I'm curious to hear what you all have never done. I have unfortunately been in an ambulance. I have. Here, here I am. <laughs> That's the name of this one. It is a really, really cute, kind of a chunky hair clip. You even have the little teeth there to, to grab onto the hair. And it has a beautiful, kind of an iridescent um, look to it. Aw, thanks, Arden. 
It's my turn to get to know all of you. Sold 106, here I am. No, I, I, ha I have to admit it, and hopefully my mother's not here. <laughs> I did skip school. <laughs> I did. Like, senior skip day, you know, most of the schools, I think most of the seniors do that. We did. Although I probably have never told my mother that. I don't know. <laughs> <gasps> Springtime social. Navy blue with the white polka dot. This too, a little hair clip. So cute if you put a sloppy bun or put it at the top of a ponytail. Sold 107, 107 navy blue with the white. I have, and the one you probably will be, uh, I'm probably one of the few people that have never done this. My last one. Uh, give me a spring. This is a mint green suede hair clip. Right, cute little dainty. No, I have gone. Oh, <laughs> my, my mother's here. <laughs> Hi, mom. <laughs> All right, so she knows that I've skipped, I skipped school. So Barbara St. Ange is my mother. <laughs> uh, hey, Nicole. I, uh, I did, I have gotten a ticket. I have watched Star Wars multiple times. Uh, <laughs> busted. <right? laughs> oh, God, that's so funny. So funny. <laughs> Sold 108. Did you know that, Mom, though? You probably did. She knew everything. I know, aren't they cute? Here it is in pink. Whoops. Nope, I've gotten a massage. I gotta make sure that you guys didn't say it and I missed it. So, Mom, did you hear me talking about Billy Ray Cyrus? You remember Achy Breaky Heart? So, I have not done six. So, Nicole, I don't know, did, did you see my post that I put up a, a few hours ago? Never have I ever. And there was a list, a bunch of items on there. Um... So people are trying to guess. There are six things on that list that I have never done. People have guessed five of them so far. So the five that I have never done is, I actually have to open it up. I have never broken a bone. I have never fired a gun. Uh, I have never had braces. I have never gone scuba di scuba diving. I've never gone zip lining. And there's one more on that list. So you guys guessed one, two, three, four. Five. You guessed five. There's one more that I have never done. Nope, I've done horseback riding. I've done camping. Oh, Megan, I wish. <laughs> no, tell me you have never seen the grays when I have my head down. <laughs> I have done that. <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, next Saturday is going to happen again. 
so <laughs> the pink one's 109 109 uh, you guys guess the last one then you need to start telling me what you haven't done this is the black and white little hair clip splattered splendor nope i've been on a train i've been on a train look how cute these are here comes trouble here comes trouble two little clips these two have the little teeth iridescent and pink <laughs> yes right mom <laughs> Mom, do you, you know what that the sixth one is? Sold 111. 111 for the pink. I also have it in white. Here comes trouble in white. The double look two clips. And they're solid clips. Like this will hold hair. Sold 112. Jana, that's it. Been on a cruise. I have never been on a cruise. Ever. We were supposed to go this past August, but canceled due to COVID. So cruise is the sixth one on that list that I've never done. Never, never been on a cruise. Someday I'll get there. All right. So share with me something that you have never done that you would like to do. What is something on that list that you've never done that you would like to do? Here are a couple of men's pieces uh, or unisex. I would totally wear this necklace. No, we have never gone on a cruise. Tiki Thunder. So this is a black cording. It's actually four cords. Um, I'm pretty sure you can, you can, you can. So you can lengthen by pulling these knots. I don't know if you guys can see that. Right, lengthen this. So this could actually go quite long if you slide those little slip knots all the way up and then pull them back down to shorten this. The lower, cute, you have brass, uh, this lava rock, little hoop with a bead in the center. Tiki Thunder sold 113. Ooh, you'd like to meet Tom Brady, or is that something you've done? Ah, uh, Megan. I highly, highly suggested. It is the most incredible thing I have ever done. It was, we actually already bought tickets to do it again. Sold 113, 113. A cute bracelet that would go is this silver with a tin finish. I wouldn't mind meeting Tom Brady. <laughs> Pull cord closure. Ah, oh, Darlene, you'll have to come with us. <laughs> Shauna. <laughs> Goal is the name of this. That's Jada's goal. Sold 114 in silver, and it has, like I said, that tin finish, which I absolutely love. 114. place in particular, Edna? I think we had talked about this once before. 
this is a long gun metal, elegantly ensnared. Um, so if you are new to paparazzi accessories, all of the necklaces, and I should have mentioned this uh, earlier, they do come with a pair of matching earrings, unless it's, unless it's an urban. They also, if there is a lobster claw clasp, they will have at least a two inch extender on there. Gorgeous gun metal, long necklace, probably can't see it too, too good on the black. Hey, Angela, the list is posted on uh, Facebook. I posted it about, oh, may, I don't know, three hours ago, something like that, three, four hours ago, maybe. Never have I ever. So go back and definitely comment, even if you don't get to, a chance to do it till later. Anybody who hasn't um, commented on it, yeah, I am ready. <laughs> I'm ready. As soon as all this craziness is over. We are hoping. England. Mm. Have you, by any chance, I know I asked the question the other night. Um, have you, by any chance, watched um, The Crown? I have been watching that and I find it so interesting. Living Off the Grit sold 116, a gunmetal cuff. Kind of this large, you know, molded link cuff. Now, this will show on, in the photos, on a man's wrist. But, I have a medium-sized wrist, which I forgot to measure again. <laughs> and I even wrote it down that time. Um, but it does have some give, so you definitely can squeeze that down. Sold 116, and this cuff, also gunmetal, so it looks like bangles, but they're actually connected by bars. This one runs a little bit on the small side, so I won't, like I would have to kind of open it and I don't want to stretch. Sold 116, I mean 117, I'm sorry, 117 street refinement in gunmetal. All right, I'm gonna move that over there. We are gonna jump over to, what do I have here? Royal blue iridescent uh, and a smoky iridescent bead. Tiny, comes down to the V shape. I'm like way over here thinking the camera's way over there. I'm sorry. <laughs> Iridescent Illumination sold 118. You have that gorgeous blue. Sold 118. 118. Now with that, I've got a couple of different bracelets. An acrylic, cute, dainty acrylic. This has the silver hook closure. So this one is pretty flexible. To get that on, it flexes pretty well. And you just snap it in. Easier said than done. I think you might need two people. <laughs> There it goes. Really, really cute. Beautiful blue with the silver. Oh, it unhooks pretty easily there. Sold 119, 119 blue acrylic. Here is another acrylic larger cuff. The colors on this, gorgeous. Cosmic Couture. Cosmic Couture. Sold 120120. 120. So if you're just joining us, if you are new to Orbit Jewelry or Paparazzi Accessories, let me know. Say hi. Let me know you're new. Let me know where you're from. We have a one-time registration. 
that is pinned in the comment section. And they're beautiful, aren't they, Arden? Um, if you're already registered, no need to do it again. But what it does is it creates an account with Orbit Jewelry. So this program that we use, Common Souls, as you can see, there's a uh, sold and a number for each piece that I show. When you claim that piece by commenting sold in the number, it automatically goes into a shopping cart. So as long as you're registered, you see that shopping cart and you can access that at any time, add to it, remove items from it and check out by 10 p.m. 10 a.m. Eastern <gasps> on Sunday. So our week runs Sunday through Saturday. We do ask that you check out uh, Sunday morning by 10 a.m. Eastern. I'm actually in Rhode Island and the cards will expire, dump, whatever term you want to use at 5 p.m. Eastern on Sunday. Um, so it's important to make sure you're checked out prior to that. Hello, Mrs. Buckley. How are you? Now, the other bracelet that I have is a blue, royal blue lava rock. This is a stretch. Your textured beads. We do honor the buy 12, get your 13th piece for free. So how it works with Common Sold is for every 12 pieces of jewelry that you purchase, I then put a credit on your account to be used towards your 13th free piece. Also pinned in the comments section is a loyalty reward app that you can download. That is not required, but I highly encourage you to download that app um, because not only does it track those purchases and you get a stamp for each uh, piece and you know exactly how close you are to that 13th free piece, but I also use it for notification purposes. So I send out uh, blasts and you may have already gotten one if you uh, are signed up, letting people know that I'm going live. So, sold one, two, one, one, two, one. This beautiful blue rising stardom sold 122 snake like chain. Again, you've got your matching earrings. Sold one, two, two. A little bit longer necklace, but gorgeous color. That's like Caribbean blue. Talking about cruises, Caribbean blue. All right, let me move this over here. And I almost wore this necklace tonight, but then I said, you know, I'm kind of in the casual mood. <laughs> so I'm going to go casual. But this is beautiful. This necklace I do have in silver. I actually showed it the other night. Um, so the other great thing about having an account with Orbit Jewelry, if you miss a live sale, you can always go to your account, scroll up, and you will see everything that I've shown on a live. And you can add to cart right from there. Um, so when you're on your account and you click on shop, that actually will bring you to the items that I've shown on the live. But I always keep our videos up, so you're welcome to watch the replay if you'd like. Hypnotized in yellow gold. So I can grab the silver if anybody wants to see this in silver. This is a blockbuster. So blockbusters are pieces, if it sells out, we know it's gonna come back. Uh, many of the other pieces with paparazzi, once it sells out, that's it, it's gone. Uh, never to be seen again, or we might only see it in a different color. Uh, but blockbuster pieces, we know will come back if they sell out. Sold 123, 123. Beautiful sparkle on that. I have a couple of bracelets that I have paired that necklace with. This is a daintier. It does have a lobster claw clasp and the extender, which seems to jump onto my fingers. That zigzag detail. Sold 124, 124. Anybody doing anything fun this weekend? The 
kids are surprising us on oh you did good um, the kids are surprising us on Sunday as part of our Christmas gift um, they're taking us somewhere we have no idea where we're going uh, all I know is we are leaving here at 9 a.m. Sunday morning I said how do I dress they said casual I said okay <laughs> No clue. Full circle. So I paired this because this bracelet has some of that hammering, just like the necklace. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces on this bangle set. Sold one, two, five. One, two, five. So I'm kind of anxious for Sunday to see. So I'll be able to fill you guys in on. Sunday night. All right, I have two of the Life of the Party pieces available. So Life of the Party, we did show these the other night, three of the pieces uh, did sell. Um, and I'm trying to think, did I post? I don't think I did a post on Facebook, but I know that they're on the website. So when you go to the website, click shop and then select Life of the Party, you will see um, the most recent five pieces that were posted. And I have two of them, three have sold and are in folks' carts right now. I have two different uh, styles available, but you can pre-claim these. So I will base my ordering, very similar to Fashion Fix, I will order these on the 15th, midnight going into the 15th. Um, so when you go to the website, look at Life of the Party, if there are any of those, uh, the first five pieces that you see, if there are any of those that you do want, you can add them to your wait list and I will do ordering. Dazzle by default. Rhinestones. The edge on here are just a cute little silver bead chain. Um, you could actually put this either on the outside of this rhinestone ring or through the center post back really cute sold one two six one two six for those almost knocked my little basket over this necklace is absolutely adorable heart on your heels oh nope sorry that one is i'm gonna show it even though it shows a zero it is sitting in someone's cart but this one can be ordered so you can put this, add this to your wait list. They look like little locks. How cute is that? With Valentine's Day coming up, a chunkier chain. Sold 127, 127. And look at that sparkle. So please like and follow. Actually, I'm gonna show you one, two, three. Oh, the earrings have already been shipped out. I'm going to show you the bracelet. Uh, this too can be, it's going to show as a wait list item. Sold 128, your pink rhinestones. And the gorgeous thing about this bracelet is the closure. So this just has this little ring that you pull to widen that. And then you pull to shorten it and tighten it. How cute is this? Sold 128, 128, 128. So I know that one is sold. So that is a waitlist item right now, but I will make, do the ordering and a statement ring. If you like statement rings, this is a statement ring. Oh my goodness, it is gorgeous. Sold 129, look at this. The detail is beautiful, that beautiful emerald cut, that red. Sold 129, stunning, 129. Undefinable Dazzle. So 
So those are the life of the party pieces. There is also another earring. You'll see it on the website. Um, it is a, a cluster of faceted pearls, like teardrop shaped pearls, all clustered up in a ball at the end. That one's already been shipped out. All right. What are we doing? So behind me, I kind of went with a multi-metal theme here. Um, so I'm going to jump and start at the top. This one, gunmetal, silver, and rose gold. Gorgeous. So I've paired it with rose gold, the square hoops, like a silky sheen. So like I said, gunmetal, silver, and rose gold, the three-tier downtown reflections. This is sold. Oops, where I go? I tangled. There we go. Oh, maybe not. Sold 130. 130. Beautiful. It comes with the little silver earrings. There is an extender on this as well. 130. The hoops are a square hoop in rose gold. I'm afraid I'm going to get hooked. <laughs> Sold 131. 131. 131. Like, follow us, uh, click those three little dots, turn on notifications, uh, spread the love, which is what we call sharing. So every Wednesday, we do a spread the love giveaway. So I go through and anybody who has shared a video or a post uh, within the past week is automatically entered into our weekly drawing, which we do on two, on Wednesday nights. So I give away two free pieces uh, for the spread the love giveaway. I am live Sunday and Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern and Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern. Faithfully, every week I'm here. I'm here, I'm here. All right, let's jump to this one. <clears throat> Last call on these earrings as well as this bracelet. This is gunmetal and yellow gold. So that two tier necklace, I will bring this and scan them each in individually. So I've paired it with these gunmetal, but these would be amazing with it as well. Oh, I'm gonna just drop the bracelet. <clears throat> Let me. So we're going to start with the necklace. Brazen Beauty. Gunmetal, yellow gold. These two, whoops, I'm like back. I'm so used to, I'm like over the over the monitor, if not the phone. Sold 132. I changed things up a little bit and now I got to readjust my brain beautiful gunmetal and yellow gold two of my favorite metals together 132 whoops the gunmetal fish hook backing kind of a medium size shiny gunmetal with just that little bit of texture across the center These are sold 133, 133, 133. Yellow gold, now this one has silver on it as well. So anytime you've got gunmetal, yellow gold, silver, you can like mix layered necklaces, put the metals together, which is actually what I did with this one. I just put the gunmetal and the yellow gold, which also has, I don't know if you guys can actually see that. I might have to move her over. Uh, these are sold 134. 134. Very, very lightweight. 134. 
and the bracelet. Yellow gold, silver, and gunmetal. Stretchy. Sold 135. 135. That is a lost call on that one. And that one is gone. Gone, gone, gone. All righty. Let's come over to this one. So same necklace, actually, uh, but this one is yellow gold. I'm in the wrong area. <laughs> yellow gold and silver. Uh, and I paired it with yellow gold hoops on this, this one. So you've got that smooth and the hammered two layer. Sold 136, 136, your matching earrings. 136 for that one. And the hoops, is Julie here? Julie, are, are you here? Whoops. The hoop earrings she was looking for. Trish, are you here? You can let Julie know, um, or I'll message her. I was able to get those big puffy silver hoops that she was looking for. Totally off the hoop. Sold 137. 137, these have a little bit of texture to them. A larger hoop. Sold 137. 137. And I tried so hard to get, um, I looked for those crawlers, the ear crawlers. I know everybody's looking for those. Um, no luck on those. Nobody seems to have those in, in stock. Ouch. Now this, are, these are two different necklaces. So this one, yellow, this one has yellow gold, silver, and copper. Same thing with this kind of a floating bead. This is gorgeous, actually. And the matching earrings. So I will start, actually, I'm going to start with the earrings so that I don't tangle anything up. Do chime in. <laughs> Do chime in. Yellow, gold, silver, shiny copper. Beautiful. You can use these with so many different things. You know, your primary color necklace, let's say, is silver, and you want to just pop in a copper bracelet or a gold bracelet. That's just going to pull it all together. Top Zen. Now, I do have the extender all the way out on this one, so these just look like they're floating. Right? You're on that very thin wire, yellow, gold, silver, and copper. Sold 139, 139, this is so, so pretty. 139, and the longer, so your silver chain, so your primary color on this is silver, and you've got the yellow, gold, copper, and silver little rings, sold 139. Four zero, one four zero. Stack them up. All right. So that is our little multi-metal mini marathon. Multi-metal mini marathon. Oh, except for these two. On Miss Jewel. So both of these, same necklace, but you've got your gunmetal primary and then your yellow gold primary. Both have the silver, yellow gold, and gunmetal, just kind of like in a different order. So I'll start with the gold. One forty one, one four one. 
Which would be cute with this too, is if you, uh, when you unhook them, if you layer them, you could kind of twist the, the gunmetal and the gold chain together and it really would look as, like it's one necklace. And here's the gunmetal, 142. With that multi-metal, the little rings. And this one has your little primary or your gunmetal earrings. Or shorten one of them. Look how cute. I don't know if you guys can see that. Right? Can you see that? Can you see her? How cute it would be if you shorten one, left one long. And the long gunmetal fish hook, very lightweight, sold 143. 143. 143. Cute. over there so I don't knock you over and we're gonna jump in to some other stuff all right boom, 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 boom. who else has gone horseback riding if you've gone horseback riding, let me know. And let me know if it's something you would do again. Because <laughs> I did not enjoy it. <laughs> I did not enjoy it. They're beautiful. I would love to own a horse um, and take care of it. And I, I just don't want to ride it. <laughs> do you, did you love it? Arden, do you, do you enjoy it? Would totally do it again? All right. Yes, you've been. No, you wouldn't do it again, Lisa. <gasps> Megan's done it. Angela, Sunset Stables. Mom, you would do it again? <laughs> when I was you, when I was you get, <laughs> I think I know what you're saying. <laughs> and that's so not true. <gasps> Oh, you would. I, I just found like the power of the horse. And I don't know, maybe it was the horse I was on, but I found it a bit scary. Younger. Okay, yeah, got it. Yeah, I don't know. I wasn't a fan. Um, Brad and Caitlin did when we went to the Bahamas a few years ago. They went uh, horseback riding and... Sean and I are like, no, we'll just stay on the beach. <laughs> We're fine. <gasps> yeah, right, Lisa, I get it. But I just find it, I, I was more scared on a horse than I was jumping out of an airplane, if that makes any sense. All righty, look at these two. One remaining in each of these colors. I am going to scan them each in individually. first one in the black and you have that smoky gray large cuff now these do um there's there's really not any give to these i have again medium size wrist but look at that sparkle holy cow 144 
Um, you know, and I, like I said, I don't know if it was just the horse I was on and <laughs> it was one of the, we went, um, at Guarded Park here. They took me for Mother's Day a few years ago. Very, very sweet, but, um, yeah, I wouldn't do it again. <gasps> one, four, four for that one. And the blue. Come on, scan. Here we go. 145. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, gentle, right? And it probably it probably depends on the, the horse. No, the there's a family that lives up the street. They have two. And my daughter would go uh, riding over there a, a lot. And they are, oh my God, they're the most beautiful horses. Actually, one is expecting um, in April. And I would love to be there. Sold one, four, five, that gorgeous blue. Autocorrect, right? <laughs> Beautiful blue and silver. Large cuff. Stellar Radiance 145. 145. All right. I was shocked when this one came in as a hostess reward. Woo. Just this really flexible, like mini coil. Stage worthy sparkle. 146. 146. Gorgeous. Yes, it does, Angela. <laughs> Except, like, skydiving, we did that in September and I loved it. I cannot wait to do it again. So, you know, I guess we guess have different. Um, Sensations, maybe. Oh, how, that's right. How is she doing, Jana? Surgery was this week, right? Give her our love. Give her a kiss for me. This is a wood, yellow, and your brown with little silver textured discs for individual bracelets stretch now this one you will not see a photo with this sold 147 147 lisa i knew you were going to love that bracelet sold 147 i knew you would love that one this gunmetal ring is beautiful she's just a ton of pain oh poor thing Miss Deanna had to have surgery on her ankle. Gunmetal, turning the tides. Look at this one. Standard stretch. Sold 148. 148. 148. See, isn't that funny? Like, but you know what? Your mind wasn't thinking about the height, right? At that time. Like your focus is somewhere totally different. Downright Desperado. Men's or women's, unisex. This is a brown leather. Uh, this one, definitely the more you wear it, the softer this leather will be. There are three snaps for sizing, all connected by those silver studs. Sold 149, 149 chocolate brown. Copper. Copper. Another love story. Really dainty, cute. You have your matching earrings. 
Now, the detail on these hearts, I don't know if you can see it, they're little hearts within the heart. So, so cute. This is a great late layering piece. Dainty necklace and then put a little bit of a longer one. Layer it up. Or add a chunkier, more statement necklace. I mean, earrings. Sold 151. Two different textures on those hoops. Fish hook backing. Sold 151. It almost kind of gives the um, like impression of uh, an animal print, this outer one. That's what it kind of reminds me of. Yes, Valentine's Day. Oh my God, check out these brass earrings. These are some of the hostess rewards, uh, the pieces that I have gotten. Look at these things. Ugh. Mixed movement, brass, gorgeous. Sold 152. 152. My jacket keeps getting caught on my table. Three piece bracelet. So you have your clear faceted beading with the silver. Hello Beautiful is the name of this piece. <gasps> Sold 153, 153. 153. All right, let me put that, those pieces to the side. And I'm gonna grab a few others. Actually, I have a ring that just came in. Here it is, that I'm going to put with this piece. I need to put this on a bust because I never can hold this whole thing flat, flat on my hand. Oh, maybe I got it. <laughs> Medallions, myself and I. 154, beautiful silver with that bright yellow. It'll bead right inside. I am going to put it on a bust so you can actually see what it looks like. Flat. Look how cute this is. One five four, one fifty four for the silver and yellow I have with that let's see what I pulled this ring actually just arrived today this one has the yellow crackle stone the uh, standard band but look at the detail on this I love how this silver comes down Sold 155, 155. Very typical 155. I also have, let's see what else I have. Now this, these earrings, I actually pulled to go with this necklace. So this necklace, I'm going to hold it up. All right. So it is a long necklace. You have this larger piece. This is a solid piece with your tassels hanging down. The earrings are a little tassel earring as well. So with this necklace, I actually have a couple different things that I would pair with this. Right, look at these earrings. Whoops. Yellow leather. It's kind of like a mustard yellow. Right, so 
So you can put yellow. I have a yellow acrylic bracelet that I would pair with that. Even that yellow ring that I just showed would be really, really cute. Or you could totally change it. Oh, I do have this yellow cuff bracelet. So we'll scan the yellows in in a moment. But you could just pop in red. And pair it with some red. So I've got the red ring, bracelet, earrings, and or the yellow. So we'll start with the necklace and then we'll kind of pull in the different pieces that you can pair that with. Alrighty. This one. Look at this gorgeous detail on this necklace. Your tassels sold in 156. 156 for that. These earrings are amazing. Friends of a leather in the yellow. So, like I said, it's a mustard yellow leather. Aren't these gorgeous? Sold 157, 157, acrylic, acrylic, so this will pull in, this is a great, um, I mean you can wear it year round, but think about this like in the summertime, because when that sun or the light hits it, it has an, a little bit of an iridescent. Sold 158, 158. And this cuff has the crackle stone. So just like the ring, you have your crackle stones. Cuff bracelet. Medium fit on this one. It does have uh, some flexibility to it, so you can squeeze it down. Stone Sage sold 159. One five nine, beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's take a look at some red to go with that necklace. Now this one, standard stretch. Red crackle stone again, detail galore. One six zero, one six zero, one six zero. Stretchy red enamel, it's a deeper red with a textured silver. Stretch bracelet, dancing dahlias. Dahlias is one sixty one. Again, that deeper, a little bit of a deeper red fish hook backing. These are sold one sixty two, one six two. So for those of you that are local, um, we will be making deliveries. I'll probably be making deliveries tomorrow just not knowing what's going on on Sunday. The kids are surprising us with something. Um, and I have no idea how long we'll be. I have a show Sunday night, so it will be uh, tomorrow for local deliveries. Long necklace, solid red, kind of that, it looks like glass, looks like marble, your daintier rings, multi-chain at the bottom, gorgeous, long, 163, sold 163, seriously, $5, <laughs> it's nuts, 163, 
little bit of red for Valentine's Day. Bubbly Bright. This is a red rhinestone. And then this solid bar down here, you've got your three. Snake-like chain. Sold 164. 164. So a little pop of color, a little bit of pop of color. A little bit of the larger teardrop shape. So this one has a, a tiny red rhinestone. It's actually on both sides with a little bit of texture in the upper part. Sold 165, 165. Time I lift my left arm, my jacket gets caught. Love this bracelet. This is one of the pieces I think you can you can dress this up, or you can um, make it work totally casual. That antiquing, and it's dark enough. You can pull gunmetal in with this one, and then that beautiful red stone 166 166 I'm going to turn that basket that way there we go fish of backing garden state glow 167 red moonstone earrings or bracelets so this one has a bit of a, a little bit of a moonstone um red moonstone let me think let me think let me think there's these one six seven hold on one second let me grab I do not, Lisa. They're all, um, that's the closest. Those earrings are the closest to Moonstone. I have um, like the, the solid color beads, some clear beads, but not an actual Moonstone, unfortunately. Unfortunately. Acrylic earrings or necklaces. I do have acrylic earrings and uh, I have a couple of necklaces I will grab them crank it up red this is a dainty so this is the standard stretch this is the dainty you'll see the dainty on some rings this has a beautiful red sold one six eight one sixty eight um, let me grab the um, do I have any Go grab those. Hold on one moment. Let's start with, let's start with these and grab a few and in no particular order. <laughs> um, so this necklace, 
in the acrylic. I have this um, kind of a natural, the natural tones to it. I'm gonna sit this one on a bus so you can really see what it looks like. And then the tortoise shell. So let me move that necklace out of the way. And I think I'm gonna use this one. It's a little bit longer than the other. So this is the tortoise shell acrylic. This is sold 169, 169, and they're just all these interlinked links. It's beautiful in silver, 169. The earrings that come with that necklace, and it's a little bit of a longer, and you have still have the extender, right? 169, gorgeous. That is one. I have the lighter, kind of those natural tones. Right, this one too, let me get this one to sit flat. Whoops, did that one scan? It did not, hold on. There it goes. This one will be sold 170, 170. So let me get that one to, there we go. That's what that one looks like. 170, gorgeous. So much you can do with that one. So that is that one. I have this one. This beautiful color. Let's do it that way. Courageously chromatic. This is sold 171. 171. I think this bottom one, if you go that way, there we go. 171. That just is beautiful. 171 for that acrylic. And I also have this red, which is um, like a burnt red. The Larger Links Acrylic Necklace. Turn up the heat. Sold 172. 172. And it has a little bit of like marbling, right? So you've got some touches of the black in there. 172 for that one. Some earrings. Ooh, got some cute ones. Look at these acrylics. Beautiful. Gorgeous colors. Like a cranberry, the blue. Retro Renaissance sold 173, 173. One seven three. Now I have, and did I bring it out? I have a cuff bracelet that matches this earring. So I will grab the, the bracelet too. This is a post back excuse me, post back earring. These are beautiful. Very, very lightweight. Any acrylic earring is gonna be extremely, extremely lightweight. Let me grab the bracelet like that. Um, I think I already have it. And 
I do with it? What did I do with it? It is right here. Here is the, and I only have, I have one of the bracelet available. So here's the matching cuff. to those earrings. 175, 175 for the cuff. How gorgeous that is. Like seriously, $10 for that set. Nuts, nuts, nuts. Now, you're not Angela, let me double check and see if they're going into your cart. Um, I see the silver with the, the necklace with the silver, with the, sorry, the yellow beads and I see the yellow ring, but hold on, could, let me check wait list because it's possible, um, actually let me go to your customer account. So this necklace, this necklace went into your wait list, which means it, it sold out. So it's sitting in your wait list. Was there anything after that one? But you should have received a notification. So I so show that one in the wait list and then I show the other two, the silver. You're not either Arden but everything's going to your cart. Uh, Angela, I think, I think that was with the three pieces. If I'm just, I'm just quick doing a quick scroll through comments. Yeah. So leave whatever falls into your wait list. Don't remove it from there because I work with team members to see if we can um, exchange pieces because I may have stuff that their customers are looking for, vice versa. So we always try to get what we can. Um, and I may get something in, in a hostess reward. You never know, ever, ever know. Um, these are beautiful acrylic earrings. Uh, Paparazzi just released a cuff bracelet just like this today. Unfortunately, uh, it sold out before I could grab it, but they are available and I probably could get it uh, for you if you're interested in the matching cuff bracelet that goes with these earrings. Uh, this is a gunmetal post back earring. This is sold 176, 176. It was so funny, I had a bunch of uh, these and I traded some, I have some, but I traded some uh, with a team member and just yesterday, like I just packaged the box up and sent it to her. And today they came out with the cuff bracelet. I was like, oh my gosh, who knew? Who knew? But I have, uh, I still have eight, like eight of those left. Look at the color on this acrylic earring. This is stunning. Silver, post back, stellar stylist. These are beautiful. I have three of these available. Only three available. Sold 177, 177. They are so, so pretty. Here are, I've got two different colors. Uh, actually, I have, 
three different colors in this one. Where's the other? Yes. So here is one color. So this is not the one I scanned. Let me scan the first one. So this will be 178. This is a beautiful, it has a little bit of um, some sparkle in there. So a green pulls in some brown. You have kind of a seafoam green. Post bath acrylic, beautiful. So I've got that color. I have one pair available in this color. So this one more of that, um, almost like a rose gold coppery color on this one. That is sold 179, 179. And then I have that same earring in this color. Now each earring, all, all the earrings, each one you pick up is a little bit different. No two are exactly the same. So this one's a bit lighter. So 180, 179, and 178. You can kind of see those different colors. Those. I also have, and I know I've got a couple of, just saw them. I just saw them. Here they are. This is another acrylic cosmic rainbow. These will be sold 181. So this one definite iridescent. Uh, this one picks up the green, the blue, the pink. Beautiful. One available in this color, but I have another. I have it in a beautiful, just very beachy. Oh, I forgot I had it in pink, too. I love when you guys um, ask for things because sometimes I try and make sure I have, like, a variety of stuff shown, but so this is a beautiful color. Very summery, peachy, cosmic rainbow also, but you're just a lighter Color, that one too it has the iridescence super super lightweight 182 I have it in pink as well so the pink actually shows this one really shows the the different colors that it picks up 183 183 <laughs> oh, I get it. I get it. It's <clears throat> so hard to, but I do have one more acrylic piece I have to show you. <laughs> it is another acrylic cup. Holographic Aura. Like no matter which earrings you wear, <laughs> With that, oh, gorgeous. That's just gonna pick up whatever color you have on. Like I'm looking at it this way, I can see purple, I can see green, I can see blue. Um, the light, I don't know if you're really picking up like all the different colors in it with that light. Sold 184, and that one is gone, gone. All right. So you know what you do <clears throat> Sunday? You check out, 
and then you hurry up and you jump on the website and you add to cart and then you know you have another week before you have to <laughs> pay for those, right? <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. Let me move. Let's play a game. Let's do a quick game. Um, give a credit on account. So, let's do, let's see what I have in this one. I forget what's in this bag. It's in this container. This one is, okay, the Gilligan's Island game. Most of you know this one, right? So everybody is going to comment, comment one Gilligan's Island character, one Gilligan's Island character, and the second person that comments it correctly or comments the one that I pull, so comment one, no, you know what? Just comment one Gilligan's Island character. If I pull the name and you all match it, you'll all get a credit on your account. That's what we're gonna do. So comment one Gilligan's Island character, and I'm gonna pull a name out of this little bucket in a moment. But I'm gonna show a couple more pieces while you guys are commenting. Okay. Here is a long, now this one was, I just took it out of the package. So you're gonna find uh, there's some bending with the beading. On a mini type of, any type of like bead type necklace, uh, something that has that, that wire, seed bead, anything like that. When you get the piece, you take it out of the package. If there's any type of a bend in it, hang it. Just let the gravity take over like it's doing to many of us, right? <laughs> Pushing the cheeks back up. Um, let it hang. If after a couple days, it's not, most of them pretty kind of fall into place. You can always take a hair dryer, low temperature, and kind of warm it up and soften that up and it will then fall correctly. Uh, this one is 185, so it has this tan bead. The lower section, the tiny little tan beads, beautiful little detail, and your tassels. Sold 185, 185. Just a cute, cute, cute long necklace. 185, 185. All right, so let me see what we have in here. So far, it's easier for me to read on this screen. So I see Gilligan, Skipper, Marianne, Marianne, Skipper, Professor, Professor Marianne. So we've got nine folks. Well, it's showing that it's nine people watching. I've got, um, bah, bah. let me make sure. There's one, two, three, four. Uh, Denise Marianne, whoops, Edna Marianne, one, two, Professor Lisa, Angela Skipper, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, the eighth might be me. One, eight, five for that. So here we go. I'm going to pull a name out. If any of you match, Anybody who has Marianne, Arden, Denise, and Edna. Do I have everybody? <coughs> Excuse me. Arden, Denise, and Edna, you three, congratulations, are going to get a credit on your account. 
for the Gilligan game. So Gilligan game, Gilligan, Gilligan, my pen just stopped. <laughs> Don't you love it? Didn't that happen to me last week too, ladies? What the heck? Here we go. So Gilligan game, Gilligan. I must have said that 90 times already. <laughs> We have Marianne Arden. Arden. And this one. Denise. Amanda. Amanda. You're welcome. She, um, she did. Brad told me that. All right. So I will put a credit right after the show. I'll put a credit. Uh, so Arden, there you go. <laughs> you can buy a pair of earrings. <laughs> um, one free piece. Credit. All right, so I'm gonna put Marion back in my little bucket and put that away. So congratulations, ladies. Congratulations. Alrighty. Where am I going? All right, all right. I went through these. I did that one. Let's move that. I'm gonna make some room over here. I have to make some. Oops, almost knocked. Move those over. Let's move that there. Okay. I love this necklace. Absolutely love this. I only have one available. Um. So I'm gonna show you the necklace and the earrings, which I also only have one pair available in the earrings as well. But I just love this. Look at this. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to scan each of these. And I just love the colors. The statement. Beach bauble. So the beautiful tones on this. These pearls that are linked together with these silver bars sold 186. 186. Love that. 186. And these earrings. Ge Geo Gypsy. Fish hook backing, lightweight. These two, love these. Sold 187. 187. With Edna, those, that necklace is yours. Okay. Love it. Love, 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 love. Here's another similar to that in red. So the layers, so this one too was in the um, wrapper. So Flamingo Flamboyance, 188, 188 uh, marble, like almost glass looking beads, and then they gradually get larger. 188. One eighty-eight. Love it. What I did with that one, so you have the little uh, bead earrings, but I thought it would look cute with these cute little hoops. Lay it on thick. Stay cute, tiny, shiny. 
silver hoop. One eight nine for the earrings. I mean, yes, for the earrings. All right, let me put that there, that there, that there, right there. All right, I have got some. Last call. Last call earrings. I guess if you want to, one and done. <laughs> Fish hook backing. So we'll go kind of quick through these. Desert Divinity, Divinity, one nine zero, one nine zero. Fish hook, one nine zero. Be beautiful pink faceted bead. Dip it glow, one ninety one. 191 copper gorgeous 192 get into a vine get into vine desert nirvana orange so that orange crackle stone, which definitely has more of a corally uh, tone to it. 193, <coughs> excuse me, 193. Plume Bloom. Post back earring. Fringe, usually you see them very long. Um, this is a shorter, which is cute. 194 plum, and it is a gorgeous plum color. Newport Nautical Silver. 196 196 love these just glues to show this has the brass and that moonstone um kind of that brass tone with your little brass uh Rhinestones around, really gorgeous earring. Fish of backing, beautiful copper. These are stunning earrings. Garden Adventure, 198, 198, 198. Uh, these earrings, they actually have a bracelet that looks like it was made for them. So this is a the Yellowstone right in the center. Uh, and I also have this bracelet. So the earrings will be 199, 199. And the bracelet 200. 200. Sold 200. What is with this like Fuzz popping out. Two zero zero. This one does have a lobster claw clasp and extender. Two zero zero. So those are a few one or last call items. I have a lot. More of where those came from. Ooh, I have another acrylic necklace. This is cute. Uh, so this is a white, looks like marble. I'm going to show you the two earrings that I actually had paired this necklace with. So this is the first pair with that, kind of that marbling. 
Um, and then these are the other ones that I had paired with this necklace. So I am going to scan this in. Whoops, if my thumb, if I get my thumb out of the way. Fashionista Fever 201. So it looks, it looks like marble, right? <gasps> Gorgeous with the silver. Acrylic, extremely lightweight, 201, 201. I'm going to put that on the bust so you can actually see what that looks like. Yeah, you'll love this, Lisa. <clears throat> the first pair that I paired with this is a longer, two, um, again, that little stone right in the center with the marbling. Stone Dwellings. I don't know. That's weird. The picture doesn't look the same. Oh no, now I see it better on Facebook. Uh, 202. So that's what those earrings look like with that necklace. 202. Or these, which are a little bit shorter. Stone Quest 203, 203 uh, for those earrings. 203. All right, this one just arrived too. Available in this necklace. What? I thought I had more of this on. This is a darker pink faceted bead, multi chain at the bottom, hammered texture. I love this necklace. This is really long. 204. 204. I love the deeper pink on this one. And the bracelet that I have has that, it's a chunky bracelet. Right, so you've got multi chains on here, but that deep pink Mega Malibu 205. This one does have an extender kind of buried in here. You can kind of see it sticking out. There it is. And the detail in these chains, I love this. Chunky chain, detailed beading, and then that bright, not bright, that deep pink faceted bead. Statement piece, 205, 205. I thought I had more of that necklace. Didn't realize it. Okay, let's see what we've got in here. In here. Empire State Elegance in black. That black with the hematites above and below. Even the back of this thing, look at this. Little matching earrings. It does have the extender. So 206, 206. Now with this one, I kind of went more on a little bit on the like casual thought when I was putting these pieces together. All right, so here is one of the bracelets. This is silver and gunmetal. So you just have your little chains. Industrial Icon 207. This one too has the extender. 207. You guys know me, I love my bling black suede that kind of that hematite uh, or that smoky gray crushed stone bling some gunmetal chain on there two snaps for sizing rhinestone rumble rhinestone rumble my tag's getting in the way 
sold 208. A clip on earring. Glitter enthusiast. So this is a clip on with that black. Sold 209. 209. 209 for the clip on earrings. Imperial Industrialism, Standard Stretch. Look at this. Gorgeous, blingy. Sold at 210, 210. This is very similar. I know somebody has a ring very similar to this in their wait list, um, which I have not been able to get yet. I don't remember the name of the, the piece. But I'm working on it. Now this one, a dainty band. A dainty band. Till queen dumb come. Till queen dumb come. I love the names of the pieces. <laughs> Uh, it's paparazzi's birthday. Well, not today, but January 1st. Um, made 10 years that paparazzi accessories has been known for an, as a party company. Party company. All right. We are going to to our bling bag. What time is it? It's almost 11 o'clock my time. So, it is bling bag time. Three pieces in the mystery bling bag up for grabs. So with any of our games or giveaways, there is no purchase required. However, you are responsible for the flat rate shipping fee of $4. So if you have a, a cart open uh, and you check out, you win, we just add the uh, bling bag mystery pieces to your um, package. If you do not have a cart, then what we do is we add the $4 charge to your account and then you just check out and pay the shipping. Easy peasy. I need everybody to comment one playing card, one playing card. Um, um, what we'll do, I'll pull a card out because I think Mr. Bling's already in bed. <laughs> he had a long day. And um, if we have a match, you win three mystery pieces. If we don't have a match, the card that I pull will not go back into the deck. And I will add another piece to the bling bag. So this is what I actually call my bling bag. That's my bling bag. And there are one, two, three pieces in there. Yay, yay. Uh, just a reminder, uh, carts are due by 10 a.m. Eastern on Sunday. Carts, anything that's sitting in a cart, if you haven't checked it out uh, by that time, will uh, expire or dump whatever word you want to use. <laughs> Expire is probably more uh, appropriate. Although the cart itself, so we set the, the timer. At one point it was like this crazy number of hours, a thousand hours before that piece would you know expire. Uh, we set it to 168. So now that's the seven days. Um, so even though you may have some hours still left on a piece that may be sitting in your cart, um, come 5 p.m. Eastern, uh, we are going to begin. And I, I had mentioned this, we're gonna, all the carts are going to be emptied because people are waiting for pieces. So if somebody claims something and they don't check out and somebody's waiting for it, um, it's not really fair to that other person. So make sure you check out so you don't lose your goodies. Alrighty, here we go. I see 
Hey Faith, how are you? Welcome. So I need the full suit. Oh, nope, now I see it. I didn't see it in common sold. Disregard, I see it now. Queen of Hearts, welcome, welcome. So I see Darlene, Ace of Diamonds, Edna, Queen of Hearts, Arden, Three of Clubs, Denise, Seven of Clubs, Faith, Queen of Hearts, Megan, Seven of Spades, whoops, my screen just jumped, Lisa, Three of Hearts, Angela, Seven of Diamonds. Am I missing anybody? Am I missing anybody? And you wanna make sure that you're registered. Okay, here we go, ladies. We ready, we ready, we ready. Drum roll, Darlene. Darlene usually does our drum rolls. She does so good at it. <laughs> Alrighty. I'm gonna take a sip of my... There's the drum rolls. Perfect. Here we go. This is so much easier to fan them out and have Mr. Bling pull them. All right. I'm going with oh, six of hearts. Six of hearts is our card. Ace, queen, three, seven, queen, three, seven, seven. So we do not have a winner. So this card does not go back in the deck. I put this one in here. So you need to come and hang out with us every live. So that means Sunday night, another piece will be in there. Sunday night, you guys are going to play for four mystery pieces. So I just have to write this in a note, remind myself. Sunday, four pieces. Yay. And bring some friends. Okay. Okay. Let's go. I have a few more um, last call earrings. These uh, flew out of here. One pair still available. Gorgeous blue hoop. Those stones go all the way around. Post back. Two one two. Two one two. One it is a beautiful sapphire blue. I need to move some of this so I can make some room here. Here is a clip. High class celebrity blue clip on earring. Again, that sapphire sold two one three two one three two one three. Pink Moonstone, Port Royal Princess. These are sold 214. 214. Mm, I love these earrings. Post back, yellow gold with pearls, 215. 215. Oh, these are super cute. Little white seed beads with the rhinestone. Fish hook backing. Twinkling trinkets sold 216. 216. An ombre, uh, po I was gonna say, it is post back, hoop. It starts with the clear. It goes into a light pink and then into a deeper pink with the little rhinestones. So 217, 217. And it is a smaller hoop in silver. But beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's see. Oh, I have those little 
sometimes I forget what I, I have. Um, I have the cute little seed beads in the yellow with the rhinestone. 218, 218. Let's see what else I have here. Boom, 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 boom. boom, 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 boom. Oh, I have some statement earrings, a gorgeous silver 219, shimmer sweet 219, 219, and let's pick one more, let's see what we, oh red, how about red because Valentine's Day is coming. Chandelier Shimmer in red. Chandelier Shimmer. That will be 220. All right, my friends. I am going to call it a night. We are back here nine, uh, not 9, 8 p.m. Eastern on Sunday night. So please join us then. I want to say thank you so much for shopping with me this week. Uh, reminder, carts check out by Sunday. Items will ship on Monday. Local folks deliveries will be made tomorrow. So you all have a fabulous weekend and I bless you. Thank you and good night. Yay. I'm so glad. Thank you. Thank you. You guys have an awesome night.